Good morning, HHS. Happy National Napping Day. Today is Monday, March 12th. Coming up on today's show, students with tattoos, TSA, senioritis, and a bunch of interesting stuff. Beware the Ides of March, Doyle. <laughs> Summer High School. My name is Doyle Dick. And I'm Chris Munoz. And this is your morning news. Eat at Country Cooking Buffet in the Valley Mall on Wednesday, March 21st from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. and to support the HHS band. Give a flyer to the cashier when you pay. Um, join the HHS band at Tropical Smoothie Cafe in Harrisonburg on Wednesday, March 21st from 6 to 8 p.m. Mention the band for a portion of your proceeds to support their trip, their spring trip to Orlando. If you have a cursing problem, we're here to help you. Hey man, what the f are you doing? Hey, that language is not okay. Although it may be accepted in households across the country, it is not accepted in schools. He's right. Well, let's hope that helped. Oh, you may have noticed students around HHS with sick tats and wondered how the heck they got that. Well, here's more on that. Around HHS, you can see students that have tattoos. Most of them get it for a specific reason, and many of them have purposes behind it. I decided to get a tattoo because I've wanted them since I was 14, 13. I've always just wanted a tattoo. Um, well, I always wanted a tattoo, but I decided the first one I get to be something meaningful. I don't really know. Like, I always wanted to see what it felt like, and it really didn't hurt that much as I thought it would, so I just wanted to get going. My tattoo is of... Uh, the disciple Michael, one of the archangels, fighting a demon in the bottom part of my forearm. I chose this tattoo because I wanted something along the lines of good over evil. That if you make the right decisions, you'll prevail. I have my dad's name on my left bicep, and my mom's name on my right bicep. They do a lot for me, so I decided to put them on my body, show them, express them how much I feel about them. First tattoo was right here on my chest. It was a J with the crown on it. Then my second one was right here. It's my little sister's birthday. And then I had another one that was right here. My other little sister's birthday. If you would like to get a tattoo, there is a plethora of places in Harrisburg that offer them, including... Uh, I got my tattoo done at Alley Cat over by South Carolina Street. Uh, I got my tattoos in Uruguay, my home country. Actually, I got them done at my house by a friend of mine. That's really good at tattoos. If you would like to learn more about tattoos, Come up and talk to these students. They'd be willing to share their experiences. That affects millions every school year. We must go and find people who are suffering, who are dying from senioritis. Senioritis is when you come to school and it's your last year and you think, oh, I don't have to do any classes anymore because I'm going to graduate. I've had that since freshman year. <laughs> not caring about your grades, uh, not wanting to come to school. Why would you not care? Because you're going to graduate and you think, oh, this is pointless. My grade doesn't affect whether I get into college anymore because I've already been accepted. This is a victim. <laughs> well, thanks guys. Those are some sick tats. 
Seniors, this is your last chance Senioritis is a very terrible advertisement for the yearbook. Add a baby photo with your favorite senior photo and a message for only $25. We also have a TSA pack. Do you like engineering, public speaking, creative technology, and teamwork? Then join the TSA today. You may be wondering, what is the TSA? Well, the TSA is the Technology Student Association, an organization who, through the use of competitive events, is dedicated to personal enhancement and leadership potential. <clears throat> if you would like to know more about the TSA, then talk to your school's advisor today. One of the events that, one of my favorites is flight endurance, and what you have to do is build a glider that is propelled by a rubber band motor, and the goal is to have it fly for the longest time. So last year I got mine to fly for like three minutes at the most. It was awesome. I enjoy TSA so much. It's a wonderful organization. Well, that's one thing that I really like about TSA is it's less about what my vision is and more about facilitating what the student's vision is. And that's my biggest goal is to continue to encourage students to take ownership of the organization and follow the directions they want to go. And as, as they're taking more ownership, um, yeah, just help lead the direction. Well, I think the sky is the limit. Uh, from what I've been seeing so far, the, I, I think we have the potential to, to have our students do incredibly well at regionals, go to states. My hope is that they do so well that we end up having to figure out how we're going to go to nationals. <laughs> Don't forget your purchase your yearbook for $60. And for lunch today, we have beef teriyaki bites, an apple roll, cheese pizza, and yogurt parfaits. That's all we have for you today. I'm Chris Munoz. Well, Brutus, and I'm Doyle Dick. This, don't forget.